how does our uh, first team compare to the rest of the kind of top six or seven clubs when it comes to academy graduates? And I looked it up, and the truth is, we are number one in terms of Premier League clubs uh, and how many academy graduates they have in their first team squad. In fact, uh, over the last season, we've overtaken Manchester United and now we have the most. We have six academy graduates in our first team squad. They are Harry Kane, Alex Pritchard, Tom Carroll, Andros Townsend, Ryan Mason and Danny Rose. Now, you may be thinking, well, Danny Rose, we bought him from Leeds for a million pounds. But he, when we bought him, he went straight into our academy. So he does count as an academy graduate. That's right. So like I said, we have six members of our academy as graduates in the first team squad. In second place is Man United with five. They have uh, your man Wilson, McNair, Blackett, Keane and Johnston. No, I've never heard of Johnston either. So United come second place. But uh, what I would say uh, is none of those players I would call uh, at Man United first team regulars. Whereas with Spurs, we've got Harry Kane, Ryan Mason, Danny Rose and Andros Townsend over the last few seasons has kind of been a regular. So that's where the major difference is, if you ask me. And that's why I think Spurs are basically the best team for young players at the moment. To tell you a little bit about some of the other clubs, in thir third place with uh, five uh, players in uh, academy graduates in their first team as well is Everton. And then in joint fourth are Woolwich, Aston Villa, Newcastle, Chelsea and Southampton with uh, four players each. But like I said, if we're going to talk about Woolwich, the only players they've got who actually could be deemed as first team regulars who've come up through their academy are Kieran Gibbs and injured Jack Wilshire, forever injured Jack Wilshire. So when it comes to it, guys, when you're talking about the future and what we can look forward to, Spurs really are the team who are investing in youth. We got Hotspur away, we spent 15, 20 million pounds on that. Everybody talks about it being the best academy in Europe at the moment. And when it comes to it, when we haven't got the financial muscle to compete with the top four, we have to invest in that youth and we have to bring those players forward. And that, I think, is why Daniel Levy picked Mopo as our manager because of his record at Southampton, bringing through players, and that's exactly what he's doing at Spurs. So let's all rejoice in the fact that we are the youngest current average age squad in the Premier League and we have sixth six even youth team graduates in our first team squad. Guys, let me know what you think about that in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube, YouTube and follow us on Twitter at Spurred on TV. Come on, you Spurs. Hi guys, it's Barnaby for Spurred on. I've got Craig Vi with me. It's time for another youth watch. We haven't done one for a while, so there's lots to catch up on. Loads, there. yeah, there's loads and loads to catch up okay, on. Okay, well, let's yeah. get it started now.